uh, skill you were speaking about the skill uh, inherent in, inherent inherent in uh, indian hockey and if they combine speed and uh, transition they'll be able to perform better uh, so can you explain more about uh, how this will help in modern hockey this is because it's, it's, if you see that uh, modern hockey after the Charles, eric salsworth has taken over he has introduced the hockey which is the is used to be the india pakistan hockey always attacking 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 every forward pass you have to open the open blade and then go for the forward that's what the every team is uh, using and then you need the skill that is skill when you have to one to one or two versus one then you you have to have a skill that is skill and that is skill in inherent of the indian players so that's why if that is there so it means that player has to given the video and the discuss you have this with the good quality now you have to develop the this quality and if this quality is the off the ball running mm -hmm. the ball where you can use your speed and take the position where you have in the better position either you pass the ball or you score the goal so if this understanding they he or uh, she has to be then i think we will part with that and uh, this is the one of the area which we are working since uh, we have to myself chris arello jugraj and the bharat chetri the entire team with our scientific uh, advisor robin because he is, uh, has to help us to how to get the speed and that's how we are working and i think that's one of the uh, biggest challenge we used to be now that in uh, champions of you we have edge with the other teams which is that the skill with the speed So, uh, coach, we have seen you in the dugouts, and we've seen how involved uh, you are. So, how do you describe yourself uh, as a coach in the dugouts? Uh, are you aggressive or? Uh... I'm aggressive, of course, no doubt about it. Because I believe that there is no room for the uh, uh, margin of the mistakes. The team which do the less mistakes in the modern hockey can win the tournaments, and that's what when we have trained. the same thing we we don't want to be do something extra we have we, we ask them to play to do the simple things which we have training them and if you do this one automatic helps to get the dead result when the player forget to do this thing that time i get uh, angry but the same time is my job also to when he comes back on the play, uh, bench i have to explain but yes uh, when the coach is charged you can see the players are the charge there is a energy transforming the energy from one body to other body and make the team entire team should be the energetic on the pitch and off the pitch mm -hmm. i don't want to see the entire team we decided that you are when you in the pitch you are throwing, throwing the all energy but when you are on the bench your shoulder is down you are not uh, is smiling you are not uh, energetic so that is a combination of the things which as a uh, official which uh, we decided uh, including me we put the energy we should show the aggressiveness to so the player when he go on the pitch he should be aggressive and should be the positive mind uh, so coach lastly we are a few days away from the asian games so what are the plans for preparation in uh, indonesia i think we have uh, uh, declare uh, announce the team and uh, is a team is a uh, youth and experience balance of that and that chemistry is working so i think now the very which i had said that this conversion and the inside the circle we are working on that but in, before that the uh, uh, we have to be be uh, very cool whatever happen in the champions of the good result and what we should not just complacent and sitting to be at that no sports is there every day you have to take the one further step and there is not a ending of the anything so the uh, asian game uh, the before asian game we have to take one more step and do something differently uh, from the other teams and that asian game as i said before also less than gold i don't think so that any team member and myself we will be compromised on that so, no i asked uh, how long before will you reach uh, jakarta the 14th we are leaving uh, the 14th the village is opening hmm. and the day village is opening we are reaching there and 19th we are playing the first match so i think five days is more than act like uh, jakarta is not a two and a half hours uh, hmm. uh, biological time difference and the is is the something like india uh, climate so we are not uh, somewhere something we acclimatize we have to go early and do this in the five days more than enough to to play and play to uh, training do the some training on the pitch and get the good result from the right from the beginning uh, thank you coach thank you for your time